hey there. Oh. oh. When did I? Oh, right. Thank you, Mr. Disgruntled Mailman. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> oh, 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 what a day brightener. It's the bag I ordered for World Bag Day! Oh. So, uh, yeah! Paws! Wow. Brand spanking new, beautiful paws by the amazing Garfi over on Twitter. Sure, I mean, I had paws beforehand. Y'all have seen him. But I was feeling the need for something a little more... dexterous. It's no secret that I'm a big fan of models and trading cards. But with these big old mitts, it's pretty hard to show them off to the camera, let alone play with them. I consulted my doctor about the best way to deal with these two freakish hands but he wouldn't stop screaming at me to leave him and his family alone. Weird, right? I thought doctors were chill about house calls, but when you show up at their house at midnight, suddenly you're a home invader. Yeah, real mature, Michael. Leave! So where modern medicine failed me, I turned to the internet. Garfi makes some seriously impressive fursuit stuff, and the minute I saw those paws, I knew I wanted a pair. Ideally in time for the next Armageddon convention. He smashed these bad boys out in about four months, and I absolutely adore them. Though I do need to point out there was some initial hiccups that did leave me a little disappointed. The paws had about three initial seams break on me with oh. one or two wears, which was not a good sign. I worn them for scarcely 20 minutes combined, and Already having seams break was, well, not the experience I was hoping for. I reached out to Garfi via Twitter about it, and they explained it had never happened before with any of their previous paws, and had thought the material was to blame. However, my good friend Maria, owner of Vixen Creations, swooped into the rescue and helped me not only fix the holes, but restitch the whole thing to be a lot more resilient as the initial thread that was used was only cotton, which broke very easily from any sort of wear. But thanks to a good friend, an evening of talking trading cards and Sonic, and some pizza for fuel, my new paws were back and ready for the next convention. Construction-wise, I don't know wholly the wizardry behind the paws, but I'm pretty sure they're made of a four-way stretch from which makes for a really snug, comfortable fit. The claws are 3D printed, and the paw pads are... Uh, well, 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 I don't know what they're made of exactly, but, but they're squishy, and I like it. With these and my new tail, I'm beginning to revamp my look, little by little, which I think is coming along really nicely. And with these new paws, I can try to do a little more content on the side of my other hobbies. You know, outside of video games. Though, don't expect the video game stuff to slow down anytime soon, of course. I have a long list of stuff I'm working through. But yeah, I just wanted to give you all a little heads up and show off these cool new paws. And, um, uh, I'm gonna go now. Looks like Michael was serious when he said he was gonna call the police. <laughs> oh, what a funny guy. Till next time, everybody. Police brutality.